Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Can you see I'm I'm using a cane over here? Yeah, you can spot the vehicle right there. Driving a little bit cricket. Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Tilly once again with another LSPDFR episode. As you can see, your boy is dressed. I don't know if you know what you can call this, but it is what it is. Uh, I was trying to look for something a little bit more vintage for the look. Um, something back in 1904 or something like that, but I just could not find any uniforms that resemble anything of some sort so i just kind of took out this outfit i'm like you know what we're just gonna rock this today me and my partner right here me and my partner in crime look at him looking hella stupid uh the reason why we're actually wearing these today uh it is because we're gonna be pulling out in this vintage type of thing going on over there i don't even know what you can call that but <laughs> it is what it is man uh hopefully you guys are going to enjoy the episode so without any further ado man let's get right to it uh let's see how this thing is gonna work for us today i think we're just gonna go ahead and just we're just gonna do whatever is in sight today like we're not really too concerned about getting any calls we're not too concerned about too much too, too many things really we just want to make sure we just out here instead disturbing the peace just a little bit but let's take a look at the inside of this thing oh my days take a look at that i hope that speedometer works though uh look at my partner right here just chilling all right it's only a two-seater so that means we're not gonna be taking anybody in today so we're gonna have to call some uh um transport if we have to arrest anybody today so I don't know man, I'm just trying this You know what, I wanna see if this speedometer works Alright, it actually works uh, Let's go ahead and step outside here And see what the hell is going on You can't really see properly though know? That's the only thing But this thing looks hella sweet though Alright, let me go ahead and turn this on Alright, let's just pretend This old lady right here Is fitted with some modern technology all right so we're gonna go ahead and run some plates uh maybe let me go ahead and let the dispatch know that i'm ready to take some calls here uh this was you want to show me 10 copy eight. that 10 8. all right so i can't even see properly what's going on over here so <laughs> i guess this angle right here is gonna be much better for us so let's go ahead and see what the hell is going on with this uh, one right. lincoln 18 citizens report a driver under the influence and right. rancho and a code, code three. Uh, All right. Call, we'll this is code call. three right here. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and find out what the hell is going on with the driver. Holy shit. No, no, no. Don't crash. Don't crash. All right. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Can you see I'm, I'm using a cane over here? Yeah, you can spot the vehicle right there driving a little bit cricket all right all right it's not gonna make a run for it is it all right let me go ahead and pull this guy over here see if he can pull over here for us or not all right go ahead and pull over for me my man all right right there will be perfect yeah right there will be right right there right there will be perfect Motherfuckers just do not listen, huh? Alright, let me go ahead and pull right here. Uh, dispatch, can I get a paycheck, please? Let's go ahead and run a paycheck here real quick. Before we can approach the driver. Alright. Suspect's license plate. It's a little bit too Four, weird. three, Frank, Union, Victor, seven, eight, three, a traffic felony. Right, Proceed so with caution. A, a suspended driver's license for the owner of the vehicle. Alright, let me go ahead and check this out here real quick. So everything else is checking out on the vehicle and the owner of this one is Chuck Norris. Alright. 
Chuck Norris has the nerve to drive with a suspended driver's license. And of course, we did a call for suspected drunk driver. So let's go ahead and approach the vehicle right here and see what the hell is going on. All right. Good Holy afternoon, crap. sir. How are you doing today? Can I get your license, registration, and proof of insurance, please? Can I see some identification, please? Let's see what's going on. Yep, you can smell a strong aura right. of alcohol coming inside the vehicle, and my partner can smell the strong aura of alcohol as well. Uh, the reason why we pulled you over is because we did get a call for a suspected drunk driver today, man. Uh, and I did observe you uh, observing all around the traffic and everything like that failure to maintain lane and all that uh did you have anything to drink today man no i i believe you're lying to me right now uh did you do any drugs today man no money no drugs huh all right uh why are you driving with a suspended license though you need to drive to work all right uh we do have an issue right now so since we got called in for a suspected drunk driver i'm just gonna go ahead and do a sobriety test on you all right just to make sure you're all right to drive uh you're probably just gonna have to do this inside the vehicle just in case i don't really have to you know what this guy i need to i need to take him out of the car he's going under arrest anyways for driving with a suspended driver's license so all right hold it all right my man uh you want to follow me over here for a minute gonna go ahead and give this guy a little bit of a fair fight over here all right i think right around here all right all right my man uh we're gonna go ahead and do a sobriety test here real quick okay i just want to make sure you're okay to drive but uh you're gonna be going under arrest for driving with a uh, suspended driver's license anyways uh but you know what let me just go ahead and do the sobriety test first uh, my mans, uh, do you mind standing on one leg for me? Let's go ahead and do the sobriety test first. Alright, you cannot do that. Uh, alright. Um, uh, Pana, you wanna do uh, a drug swap for me? I thought my partner was gonna do it. What the hell happened? <laughs> Thanks. I need to put this guy to work. I need to put this guy to work. Uh, so he's negative or not. All right, so let me go ahead and do the breathalyzer here real quick. I thought I actually asked my partner to do the drug, uh, the drug swap, but I guess not. All right, so let's see how high this fool is. All right, he just blew the scale away on that. All right, all right. Uh, partner, you want a coffee for me? Iron Hotel for you. All right, my man, you're gonna be going under arrest for driving under the influence, okay? We are code four. No further units required. You failed the sobriety test. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and uh, you know what? Right now, you wanna you wanna pet him down here real quick while I search the car. Let's see what the hell we can find here. So we do find a briefcase full of heroin and an IED as well. So we did find some PCP on him. So I guess, <clears throat> you know what, let me just go ahead and do this prayer work right here, man. All right, I'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible. All right, so, so we're going to charge this guy with driving with a suspended driver's license all right so we did find some heroin all right where's the heroin at heroin and uh ied as well is that like a an explosive device or yeah position of an explosive device and we didn't find some pcp on him as well so we're gonna go ahead and give him that I think that would be pretty much it and uh, of course driving under the influence uh of alcohol i would say like for the second time on that one just a misdemeanor charge but the rest are gonna put him in prison for quite a bit all right uh this was, can i get a transport over here please assistance required in banning uh if you don't mind i would like to get uh a tow truck as well please Flatbed, assistance right. required in banning. 
All right, so this guy is gonna be our first victim of the day. All right, our first victim of the day. Fana, come on. All right, so we just got a hit for no insurance on the vehicle. I think it's that uh, red. Oh, holy shit! That red vehicle right there. Let me go ahead and. Uh, Pull this guy over here real quick. All right. Bummer, man. All right. You wanna pull over for me? All right. Right on this side, right, right there will be perfect. Right there will be perfect. All right. We're gonna, <laughs> gonna end up doing some uh, highway patrol around here. Uh, this person, can I get a play check here real quick? Go ahead and check this plate out and see what the hell is Target going on. Target vehicle right. license plate eight five Queen Frank Sam six seven eight. Traffic violation. From what we can make out, so the driver's license is a possible wanted suspect. So that means there's no driver's license. Ten four. So we are looking at this vehicle right here and Dominic Romero. Everything else is checking out on the vehicle and uh, he has no license in the vehicle. So. Uh, that's an arrestable offense right there. So let's go ahead and approach the vehicle here real quick. I don't know how my partner is gonna maneuver his way out of this room. All right. Hello, sir. How you doing today? Can I get your license, registration, and proof of insurance, please? Can I see some identification, please? What's up with the noise, though? What's going on with that? So this guy actually refuses to uh, give us any proof of driver's license and you can smell the strong odor of alcohol coming inside the vehicle and everything like that. Um, why are you driving without a license, man? You're actually an illegal immigrant. All right. All right, man. Uh, did you have anything to drink today, man? Uh, but I do smell a strong odor of alcohol coming inside the vehicle, man. Are you lying to me right about now? Did you do any drugs today? I didn't say you look like a drug addict. I'm just asking if you did any drugs today. You could, it's just, just like a simple yes or no question, you know. Um, Alright, uh, you want to go ahead and give me a breath sample here real quick? Because I do believe that you might be driving under the influence right now. Thanks. Alright, so you just blew the scale away on that one. All right, uh, you want to step out of the vehicle for me? Dude. All right. Wait! All right. All right, my man. Uh, you want to step on one leg for me? Let's see how... Let's see if you can pass this or not. Yeah, he's going to fail that. <laughs> what a lunatic. All right, my man, put your hands behind your back. You're yeah, under arrest for driving nothing. while intoxicated and everything like that. And you're driving with no insurance as well, man. That is not good. That is not good. All right, uh, let me go ahead and get this guy well, away from the truck. Okay. Look at this. Look at this fucking guy. He actually found it to himself, like, to just drive right behind my vehicle like that. What a douchebag. Alright, partner, you wanna come and do some work over here, man? I would like you to pay this guy down, man. Alright? Yo, my man, uh, do you have anything illegal on you? Alright, we're gonna go ahead and check that here real quick. My partner's gonna go ahead and check that here real quick. To make sure everything else is checking out on you, alright? So we don't really find a few tablets in a plastic container. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and ignore that. Uh, you wanna take a knee for me? Alright, let me go ahead and search his vehicle and uh, my partner's gonna go ahead and watch him over there. What's up with this guy doing doing an illegal new turn over here? Uh, let me go ahead and search that. Alright, so we do find an AR-15 and a briefcase full of cocaine. All right, maybe that's the reason why you're actually driving with no papers or anything like that. 
Uh, this bus, can I get a tow truck over here, please? Profit, assistance right. required in the main bank arena. Alright, so while my partner is... While my partner is actually watching this guy over, I'm go ahead and uh, do a quick... Um, I wish there was like a documentation type of thing going on here. Uh, in terms of like some felony, I mean driving without unlicensed driver. I guess I guess that would be the charge because it actually does not have any. All units monitoring. We just received a complaint about like a speeding vehicle. From what we can make out, the description know, matches just, a possible wanted suspect. I don't know. Right? All right, so we did find a briefcase full of cocaine. Uh, what is cocaine? Schedule two or schedule one? Or is it schedule three? No. Should be scheduled to cocaine, cocaine, cocaine. It should be like at the top, at the top of the list. All right. Since it was a briefcase, I believe that this guy is actually trafficking some of this stuff right here. And we just got a hit for an outstanding warrant as well. And uh, let's go ahead and charge him with illegal possession of a firearm. All right. Uh, I love the possession of a firearm that AR-15 is carrying. I think I just want to go ahead and give him those chat. What the fuck are you doing, mate? Jesus Christ. Oh, shut up. But oh, this is fucked up. You are fucked up. You've been standing right behind me for... Alright, uh, there's a... This bus, can I get a transport over here, please? Required in, uh, the main bank arena. So this guy's gonna go ahead and take him in. I don't know why he's mm -hmm. gonna park right next to my vehicle like that when I'm trying to get in and shit. Alright, let me go ahead and get my partner. Partner, come on, man. We have a hit of a stolen vehicle over here that we need to go address. Alright, hopefully that, that vehicle is not gonna drive away from us. Hopefully not gonna lose that. We need to go ahead and get this guy over here with the stolen vehicle, man. Let's go ahead and pull a U-turn. Alright, I think it's a baller. Where is it? Right, uh, it's that baller right there. And this one is another stolen vehicle as well. <laughs> oh, man. But we, we spotted the baller first. So the baller is, is the one that's going to get uh, pulled over over here. Alright, we're going to pull over this guy first. Yeah, you, you just cannot, you cannot get them all, alright? Uh, this was, can I get a play check here, please? I think it's occupied once. Alright. Target Let's vehicle see. license plate, 6, 3, King, Queen, Boy, 9, 3, 2, a possible stolen vehicle, a traffic felony. Proceed with caution. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and pull this guy over. So it's a stolen vehicle. And the driver's li uh, the owner's driver's license is, uh, is suspended or something like that. All right, let's go ahead and check this info in here real quick. All right, uh, it is a stolen vehicle. It belongs to Kayla Ross. No, Kayla chill, Ross' right. driver's license is suspended, and I guess we're gonna be talking to John Francis. And this guy actually has an uh, an arrest warrant for unlicensed driver. And he's on parole as well. All right. Tri triple threat type of thing going on over here. All right. Um, driver, want to step out the vehicle for me? Stop right fucking My partner there. just going to walk right into him. Oh, he got him. 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 All right. I'm just going to let my partner put him in cuffs here. Let me, real quick. let me go ahead and search the vehicle. Boys and the band are going to love you. Go ahead and search the vehicle here. All right, we don't really find anything on the vehicle since the owner's driver's license. You know what? I don't know. I don't know how I feel. Should I like just call in? Um, I told, should I tow the vehicle or just you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and call the insurance company and come get the vehicle. Hopefully, the owner is gonna go ahead and fix up with the uh gonna go ahead and fix up with their driver's license and everything like that um my man do you have anything illegal long? on you 
Okay, good citizen. All right, we're gonna figure that out. Uh, this part. Uh, my, <laughs> holy shit. Partner, you wanna go ahead and search this fool? All right. So, I think the only charge is gonna be. Uh, that's gonna ignore the pills and everything like that. That's like a really common thing that you get. Uh, so Mr. John Francis here, he does have an arrest warrant, so he's gonna be going to jail for that. And I'm gonna go ahead and charge him with possession of a stolen vehicle as well. All right, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, possession. All right, possession of a stolen vehicle. I don't well, think I'm think gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna bother doing a sobriety test on this guy. It diversity. is what it is. Don't fuck All with right. the law. Um, how can you not uh, dispatch, can I get a transport over here, please? Dispatch, can I get the transport? Assistance required in banning. All right, uh, let me go ahead and get this insurance company to come and get the vehicle. Assistance required in banning. Here. Yo, we have arrested a lot of people in a short space of time, though. What's going on? Everybody seems to have something stupid on them today. Wanna come on? All right. So the insurance company is gonna come up, go out, come by and get the vehicle. Uh, for that expired insurance, I'm gonna go ahead and ignore that. Uh, I'll rather get some major stuff uh, out of the way. All right, let's just go ahead and go this way. I really did not want to be in any major. Uh, or anything like that, I just wanted to stick around uh, the city a little bit more for this episode. What the hell did, what the hell is going on? Did, he, did that guy just run a red light though? Maybe not, I don't know. But I would like to think not. Alright, so we're a little bit more vintage today, so it is what it is. Hopefully you guys are going to enjoy the episode, so make sure you smash the like button, subscribe to the channel as well. Uh, dispatch, uh, you want to show me 10 Roger that, 10 eight. All right, uh, civilian with a weapon. Another call just around the corner right here. I need to respond call three. Uh, are they like down here? They're not like down over here. This might be a shootout over here. I think this person is coming over here. That's the person right there. The person is right there. They're just about to walk into traffic over there. All right, go ahead and uh, pull this one over here. Let's go ahead and go this way. I thought they were down here. Alright. We don't have to shoot down anybody, man. I wonder what kind of weapon this fool is carrying. It seems like he's packing something big, though. Just tell. Yeah, 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 he's packing, he's packing. Get your ass on, get your ass on the floor. Get your ass on the floor, you idiot. Alright. Threat neutralized real quick. Alright, let me go ahead and uh, try to uh, help this guy out here real quick. I don't think he's gonna make it though. Look at the the pool of blood he just lost right there. I don't think he's gonna make it out of that. He's not gonna make it out of that. Alright, so that's uh, the CPI failed. I need to go ahead and move my vehicle out of traffic over here. As you already know guys, I do, I really do hate blocking traffic because every time you block traffic, um, it gets nasty a little bit, so let's go ahead and put it over right here, just let uh, traffic flow, and I'm going to go ahead and search the body here just to see who this fool was. This who is uh this bus can i get a corner unit over here please? assistance required and cypher splat all right so we did find a bag of math on this guy is that randy jackson 
did have to deal with uh, Chuck Norris. Now we're dealing with Randy Jackson. At least this Randy Jackson is a white guy. <laughs> Anyways. Anyways. Alright, fighter, come on, man. Just gonna go ahead and try to observe what's going on here with the uh, with this fine, fine service of the coroner over here. Right. Uh, this much, you wanna go ahead and show me 10-8? Roger, 10 eight. So we're just gonna go ahead and take what comes, all right. There you go, they already backed this guy in. Um, did the truck driver actually ran away when the gun started blazing around? <laughs> the man said, I am out of here. 49.6 oh, yeah. westbound, New York, Adam, Paul, George, Man said I am out of here. Alright. So this guy just kind of gave the coroner some hard time and they do have an expired driver's license. I thought I was going to ignore some of this, but this guy wanted to be a jerk, so I'm going to be a jerk back. Alright, Pino, you want to pull over for me? Alright, this much, can I get a paycheck? Let's go ahead and see what the hell we can find on this guy here. Target license plate. Four, zero, Robert, Robert, Young, one, nine, eight, a traffic violation. So a traffic violation. So insurance on Proceed the vehicle and expired driver's license. So it's going to go ahead and get some citations or not. As you can see, expired drive, uh, insurance and expired driver's license. So he actually oh, knows. Shit. That his driver's license is expired, but he just chooses not to do anything about it. What the fuck are you doing, mate? Oi! Who's crashing into somebody? Uh, I hate that noise, though. Oh, my partner can smell a strong odor of narcotics inside the vehicle, huh? Uh, partner, can I get your license, registration, and proof of insurance, please? Can I see some identification, please? Thanks. All right. Documentation. Uh, why are you driving with a spy driver's license, man? Oh, you like the you like this one because you look young on the photo. That's not a good enough excuse, my man. Uh, you do have an expired insurance as well. You know that, right? That's just the way it is. You don't have money to renew it. That's not my problem, my man. All right. Did you do any drugs today, man? You feeling high right now? Good for you. Anything to drink today, man? Nope. All right. So if you don't mind, I'm gonna need a drug swap from you here real quick. He might end up having to arrest this guy. Thanks. All right. So he's positive for cocaine and heroin. All right. Uh, you wanna step out of the vehicle for me? All right. I thought it would be a refuse to step out of the vehicle. All right, my man. You wanna put your hands behind your back for me? Wait for a long time. You're under arrest for driving under the influence of narcotics, huh? Alright, I just hope I don't find anything uh, I shouldn't find on your vehicle or on your person because those charges might just go ahead and pile up for you. Alright? Alright, my mans? Uh, do, you have anything, uh, do you have anything illegal on you? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and check myself. Uh, partner. Don't just stand there and look pretty, huh? Jesus Christ! Don't just stand there and look pretty, my man. Gotta get to work. Alright. What do we find? We do find some fentanyl on this guy. Alright. Uh, partner, you wanna go ahead and do a breathalyzer for me? Let me go ahead and uh, search the vehicle here real quick. Thanks. Here with a partner, you can actually do this as quickly as possible. So he's clean in terms of uh, blood alcohol level. And uh, we don't really find anything on the vehicle. Uh, this bus, can I get a tow truck over here, please? Flatbed. Right, Assistance go required in Rancho. Alright, let me go ahead and do a quick arrest report on this guy. I think I really do need to do an episode whereby... Uh, Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and do a citation here first. That's an expired driver's license. Alright, what the hell is the expired driver's license? Uh, I'm just gonna say more than 30 days. I'm gonna go ahead and give him that. 
and arrest report uh, driving under the influence of narcotics I'll say for this second time and we did find some PCP on him no it was like fentanyl yeah he's in possession of fentanyl as well all right all right so let me go ahead and give him his citation and uh we're gonna go ahead and get him out of here all right my man i do have a citation for you all right what was the citation for kind of <laughs> anyways uh dispatch can i get a transport over here please assistance required right. in uh rancho Ready. Uh, ready. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Where is the vehicle that's picking this guy up? Hurry up, mate. Oh, she's a lady. Just gonna leave the vehicle all the way over there. Uh, dispatch, uh, you wanna show me 10-8? 10-4, 10-8. So we're gonna go ahead and get like one more. It could be a call or it could be a traffic stop and then we're gonna get the hell out of here. Uh, hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. Hopefully you guys are enjoying these episodes. So like I said, if you are new to the channel man, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Drop a like on the video and please do comment down below. Let me let this fool go about his business and we're just gonna go ahead and cut through this alley right here. Uh, see if you can uh, spot somebody slacking or something. I don't know. Let's see. Go home before you're in a car. Can I get a unit started on this? Who's talking? Who's talking? These, these morons over here. You come to my various last pass local. What the fuck are you talking about? What the fuck are you talking about? One eighty six Lincoln Street is apparently a secure ground level. Okay, we got a result. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and look for one more call or just one more traffic stop, and we're gonna call it a day. Uh, we are back to where we actually started so i don't know maybe we're just gonna conclude the episode right here as well though you just never know man we have to catch something i guess this will be our last victim right here all right an expired insurance we're gonna go ahead and pull over that guy and uh this will be our last stop for the day um dispatch can i get a try play check just the other Suspect's license plate. 6 3 Ida Adam Mary 1 7 7. A traffic violation. Proceed with caution. Alright, uh, there's an expired insurance on the vehicle. Go ahead and check this out here real quick before we can approach the driver. It's just an expired insurance. It is not stolen. And uh, how many people are in here? Alright, so I think. Uh, I don't even know what's going on here. Why do we have so many names? But uh, our main guy that we're going to be focused on here is Mr. Green here real quick. All right. Go ahead and press the driver and ask him about the expired insurance. I'm nearby. I'll take the call for you. Good afternoon, sir. Oh, there's two people inside the vehicle. Uh, you can smell a strong odor of alcohol inside the vehicle. Uh, can I get your license, registration, and proof for insurance, please? Can I see some identification, please? All right. Thanks. My man, uh, you're driving a vehicle with an expired insurance, though. Did you know that? You don't have money to renew it. That's not a good enough reason, my man. And uh, the other thing, I am smelling a strong odor of alcohol coming inside the vehicle, man. Did you have anything to drink today? You're as sharp as an eagle. No blood. No alcohol in your blood, huh? Did you do any drugs today, man? No? Alright, 
I'm gonna go ahead and ask you to provide me with the breast sample here real quick just to make sure you are in in the right state of mind to be driving Thanks. right about now all right so you come back clean on that one might be the passenger uh can i get a drug swap as well please might be the passenger thanks i is a donor all right so the, uh, the driver is clean so I, I can't really do anything about that uh all right my man stay tight for me all right I'll go ahead and do the citation here real quick and i'm gonna go i'm gonna go ahead and let them go because uh, the driver is checking out on everything so i didn't even gonna do anything about that so documentation is going to be expired insurance all right it's not really anything uh who's the, i think this is the guy that's uh inside the vehicle right now with this uh mister or is this uh, i don't even know i don't even know who's this what the hell are you keep breaking the window fam holy shit just can't he, this guy just cannot have nice things all right he just cannot have nice things all right sir i uh, do have a citation for you all right what i did not print the citation <laughs> i might not uh save the, the citation here real quick let me see let me see uh da, 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 da. or did i write the citation for the wrong person i think this is the guy i should be giving him a citation for expired insurance right all right i think that's this should be the guy right here all right mr james taylor i do have a citation for you for driving with an expired insurance okay make sure you get this issue taken care of all right because the next time i might not be as um lenient with your stance all right you have yourself a nice day my man drive safe and all of that okay all right you might be the uh the designated driver of this one today so we're gonna go ahead and cut him some slack all right partner come on all right so we're gonna go ahead and wrap things up right here so since we are driving something vintage we and we are out of duty at this moment in time let me go ahead and let this but uh this was you want to show me 10 Roger seven. That, 10 7 all right so we are out of duty at this moment in time so we can go ahead and uh, have fun with this vehicle so thank you thank you thank you so much you guys so much for watching and uh yeah i will see you on the next episode like i said man if can you are new to the channel the please do consider subscribing to the channel drop a like on the video and please do comment down below as well as for right now i have been your boy Dilly, and i'll catch you guys next time man Peace.